The White Sox fans have been waiting for for more than a year. It's almost here. I think we're all waiting for a return to normal. The Sox uh, have their home opener tomorrow, and yes, fans will fill, or at least somewhat fill, the ballpark. Patrick Elwood live on the South Side. Ben and Jackie, good evening to you. Fans excited and businesses around the park as well. Tomorrow's Sox home opener, lots of excitement. In many ways, it will be similar to home openers of the past, but because of COVID, in other ways, it will be much different. At Sox Park, the last minute home opener preps are underway. The Southsiders are back in town. Unlike the shortened pandemic 2020 season, fans will be in the stands. We're so excited to have fans back in the ballpark. It's been a long time. Senior VP of Sales and Marketing, Brooks Boyer, says much will be the same. But some things, of course, will be different. No physical tickets to speed up the entry process. We have limited capacity. We have protocols. All of our tickets are, are on mobile phones. Uh, there's certain gates that you have to enter based on the location of your tickets. And the establishment of food and beverage zones, etc. Once you get into the ballpark, you will be in a zone or, or your neighborhood. Uh, that you will stay in. But all those zones are going to offer retail, concessions, bathrooms, and we're just going to make this experience the best we can possibly make it for the fans who are here. We want to do it right so we can keep it going. All fans, two and older, must wear masks unless eating or drinking. No big bags allowed, only medical bags, small purses, and diaper bags allowed as well. Fans will be seated in pods and not allowed to move within levels. And this is pretty cool. Healthcare workers from the Sox partner Rush Medical Center will be the off the field all star. Be able to take the field and throw out the first pitch to, to, uh, to make them representatives of all the people in the Chicago area who have worked so hard to fight this virus. Uh, I think it's going to be a special moment for a lot of people. In the shadows of guaranteed rate lies Cork and Carey at the park. We're excited. We're looking forward to it and hopefully things go well tomorrow and It'll carry through the season. Owner Bill Guidi says it's all hands on deck tomorrow. With the kind of anticipation surrounding the team and the fan experience he hasn't seen in a long, long time. We haven't had this many calls for reservations uh, in probably eight years. <laughs> so, so we're anticipating a great crowd. Some going through the game, some just to enjoy the atmosphere of the neighborhood. Two and two. So under the category of it is what it is, it's time to play ball. 2021 style at 35th and Shields. That ball is hit well. Deep left. So you also have to order your food and drink through the MLB app and the White Sox ticket on your phone. No tailgating. That's not allowed. There will be a special moment to recognize the 2020 MVP, Jose Abreu. Time to play ball on the south side. <laughs> Patrick Elwood, WGN News. Back to you guys in the studio, Ben and Jackie. Thank All you, right, Pat. Thanks. We appreciate it. And speaking of baseball,